friends today we will see the one scenario when we have our material cost but then after we want to add some additional uh, cost on the product and then we are adding the sales margin in the product cost and we decide the sales price so here we have a one scenario so here the material cost 100 and then after they are adding these SFC support function cost that is the 6% of the material cost so here my material cost 100 and uh, the, if we are adding the 6% is uh, on the material cost then after we have a 106 as a sales price so uh, after adding the support function cost they are adding some direct variable cost and that is the dvc so on uh, 106 we are adding the six percent additional margin dvc in the product cost so uh, the cost will be changed then after 112.36 okay and then after we are adding some contingency 2% and the finally sales margin 10%. So uh, at the sales time my uh, product, is, uh, product sales price is 126.06 based on the difference uh, different SFC and DVC and sales margin percentage. So uh, now let's check uh, the same scenario how can we configure in the Odoo. So I will show you that in the version 13. So this one is the my Odoo version 13 community edition. Okay. And let's go to sales. And we add one sales order. So if I add a product material cost then you can see the my unit price is 126.07 now let's check the actual uh, cost of the product so you can see here the cost is uh, 100 INR but uh, on the order uh, based on the my price list it will be calculated and the uh, unit price is 126.07 price okay so this is the how we can configure now let's check the configuration like if we want to achieve this kind of the case in Odoo then how can we configure different pride list over here okay so first of all we need to activate the pride list I already activated but I will show you that how you can do so here you can see the advanced price rules discount and formula so you can activate this option then after you can have access of the pride list so here you can see different pride list I have created for uh, this uh, scenario. Okay, so let's check one by one what we can do. So here uh, the material cost plus support function cost. So this one is the first uh, like uh, uh, support function cost and the material cost. Okay. So to do that, what we can do here based on the cost, we can uh, just select the option based on cost and then after we can add the price discount minus 6%. Okay, so actually it will just add the uh, 6% in the cost price because here you can see the symbol the minus. So actual formula like a cost minus price discount and plus this this. So if you want to compute the percentage, so here we can add the minus 6%. So it will ultimately add the price in the cost of the product. So this one is the my first uh, price list. Okay. Then after we need to create another uh, price list for the uh, DVC calculate. So for to calculate the DVC, uh, we have to add uh, create a new pride list over here okay now here the main thing that you have to change the option based on that is the other pride list and we have to select the previous pride list that is the material cost plus function uh, support function cost okay and the same thing that we have to do here the minus six percentage so here you can see the six percentage so we can add uh, the same six percentage over here okay 
so this one is the my uh, second calculation uh, that is uh, material cost plus sfc plus dvc okay uh, now uh, the contingency so to do that we can uh, we have to create one more priority list for that okay and uh, here the two percentage so the same thing uh, price discount two percentage here the based on uh, priority list and the previous after dvc uh, the priority list we have to select over here okay uh, now uh, after calculating this uh, we have uh, finally the sales margin on this particular 114.60 amount okay and and the my sales margin is the 10 percent so uh, we can add over here uh, the uh, margin that is the 10 percent like this and the same thing you have to use the based on other pride list and uh, we have to select the other priority list that is material cost plus sfc plus dvc and plus contingency okay so this is the how it will calculate uh, the finally sales margin 10 percent on the product cost okay so after doing this so uh, finally uh, what you have to do you can uh, you have to only choose this priority list on your sales uh, order or on the partner okay so this one is the your final uh, price list okay so now let's again go to order and check for one more uh, order so here you can see i have selected this sales margin okay and we can add the material cost and you can see the cost is 126.07 so this is the how uh, the sales price will be calculated uh, if we have a scenario something like this then we can add uh, the multiple sales price list and we can decide the, our final uh, sales price okay thank you for watching